the Pasta Family Goes to Marinara Beach. Written by Corey and Laureen Tilson and illustrated by Alex Rogers. This is the Pasta Family. They have been living in Pastaopolis for three generations, starting with Grandpa Wagon Wheel and Grandma Lasagna, who moved here from the old country. This is Tortellini, age 13. This is Fusilli, age 21, and Spaghetti, age 18. Their daughter, Mama Pene, married Papa Bowtie, and together they have six children and a family dog named Zidi. They're a very close-knit family that go on a lot of fun adventures together. Meet Ravioli, age 13. This is Gnocchi, age 25. And finally, Baby Orzo, age eight. This weekend, they are going to Marinara Beach for a day of fun in the sun. Everyone is looking forward to participate in their favorite beach activity. Fusili wants to play with Zidi. Gnocchi wants to go surfing. The twins, Ravioli and Tortellini, want to play a game of volleyball. Spaghetti is excited to work on her tan. And Orzo wants to build a sand castle. Oh, look! Our favorite spot! Papa Bowtie exclaims. Papa and I will help you set up the volleyball net and we will join you in on the game, says Mama Penne. I'm going to take Zidi on a walk to the surf shop, says Fusili. When Fusili arrives at the surf shop, he notices a poster for a surf competition. Ooh, this sounds like a cool idea, he says. I bet Tortellini and Spaghetti would be interested in signing up. Wait! Where did Zidi go? shouts Fusili. Zidi got off his leash! Fusili runs after Zidi, he hops over sunbathers, pushes through some kite flyers, and dodges some frisbee throwers. But he loses him in a crowd of bodybuilders practicing their poses on the beach. Oh, I better go ask my family to help me find Zidi, says Fusili. He hastily gathers some family members to search the beach for Zidi. In the rush to go find Zidi, Tortellini notices the surf competition poster, who Zidi dropped. I will stay here in case Zidi finds his way back, says Grandma Lasagna. Hey, Spaghetti! We should sign up for this, Tortellini says excitedly. They arrive at the surf shop and notice the list of competitors. Spaghetti shouts, look who signed up, our friends, Hawaiian pizza and cannoli. I wonder who Surfer X is, ponders Tortellini. First up is Hawaiian pizza, says the announcer over the loudspeaker. Wow, he is amazing. I have never seen anyone hang ten like that before, Spaghetti declares. The crowd cheers as Hawaiian pizza glides back to the shore. The judges give him an eight, says the announcer. Wow, this competition is fierce, but wait until they see what I have up my sleeve, announces Tortellini. The announcer calls Tortellini up and she swims quickly into the waves. Tortellini dives into her routine, surprising everyone by surfing backwards on her board. 
The crowd goes wild! As she arrives back at the shore to learn that she received a nine from the judges. I've got this competition in the bag, declares Tortellini. As the competition gets underway, the rest of the family scours the beach for Ziti. Ravioli notices some wet paw prints in the sand. Let's follow them to see where they go, says Miyoki. The family follows the tracks to the surf shack and arrives just in time to see Spaghetti catch a big wave. Her signature mo surf move is balancing on one toe with her arms outstretched. Spaghetti swims back to the shore to greet her family. As the judges give her a nine, Tortellini, now we are tied for first place. Now for our final competitor of the day, Surfer X. The crowd hears the announcer proclaim. Everyone looks out toward the ocean to spot the master surfer. Out in the distance, on a big wave, Surfer X is doing a handstand. As they get closer to the beach, the crowd notices a dog on the front of the mystery surfer's board. Hanging paws! Hey, that dog looks familiar, shouts Orzo. Papa Bowtie calls out, Yeah, I'd know that dog anywhere. It's a ziti! Mamma mia! I think I know who Surfer X is, exclaims Grandpa Wagon Wheel. I'd reckon that shape anywhere. Well, who is it? asks Spaghetti. The announcers declare Surfer X is the winner. The judges have awarded her a perfect 10. Super X floats back to the shore on her board. She starts walking towards the pasta family, holding Zidi in her arms, when they all realize that Surfer X is Grandma Lasagna. I knew Super Surfer X looked familiar, shouts Nyoki. We had no idea you could surf, says Fusili. Grandma Lasagna says, Oh, my darlings, I've been surfing since I was but a small noodle in the old country. But today, I could not have done it without the help of my little buddy, Zidi. The judges bring Grandma Lasagna her trophy. She spends the rest of the day celebrating with her family. There is never a dull day when you spend it with the pasta family.